Uh, yeah, Mike, if you could, I'd like you to keep an eye on a woman in aisle six. She just picked up a container of orange juice. She looks uh, armed and possibly dangerous. Uh, she's, we've seen her before in the other aisle. She was taking some goods and put them down in her skirt and panties. So keep an eye on her, Mike, please, or else just throw her out of the store on her head. Thank you. I am the only person who was in aisle six picking up a cotton orange juice. I find the manager in complaint. This is not funny. Yeah, I'm gonna do yeah. it. Uh, yeah, Mike, I'm gonna need a hand with security. We got, uh, we got some woman checking her counter too. She's very belligerent. She's looking to start fights and trouble with people. Uh, and I don't need anyone getting hurt in the store. Thanks a lot, there, Mike. Uh, yeah, Mike, I need you down in the meat aisle. We got a bad, awful stink coming out of the freezer there. I think, uh, come down and give me a hand. Let's check out that meat aisle, Mike. Uh, oh, oh hi. Oh, this is Saul. I need help. I slipped it on a jar of mustard. Oh, pieces of broken glass. Are, they're in my ass. Please help me. Please, I'm underneath the shelf. I'm embarrassed. Please, someone help me. Oh, oh God. Oh, I don't think I can walk no more. Hello, William. <laughs> Where are you now, William? Um, I'm, on the, I'm on the south side of the store. If you could just join me, please. Um, I'm running up and down the aisle just practicing certain little moves and dances. Uh, thank you. Bye-bye. Well, we got some, uh, veteran meat on sale. Any veterans, go down to the meat sale, and I'll personally give anybody lamb chops. Okay, Mike, we got some guy in the milk aisle there. He's got a suit on, uh, and he's got, uh, glasses, and he's bald. Okay, Mike, get over there and see if you can get it. He seems to be stealing some small containers of milk, or chocolate juice there, whatever he's got. Make sure he didn't rub it all over himself there, Mike. Okay, Mike, that guy with the blue suit on, he's uh, going bald there. He just picked up some ice cream. We may have a problem with this guy, Mike. Get down and give him a good shoe in the pants. He's been putting stuff, uh, you know, he's concealing things, so be careful. He may have a weapon. Yeah, okay, Mike, it's that guy getting the blue suit. Uh, we got him looking at the beer and sodas there. He's going bald. He may cause a problem. Sir, if we could ask you to move to the front, or we're going to physically throw you out of the store. We don't want you playing with the beers and things like that, shaking them all over, trying to steal them. So please leave that aisle, you're going to have a serious problem. Thank you. What the hell is this guy talking about? I don't know. I'm standing in front of the beer. I haven't touched any beer. <laughs> I don't know where you should go in the front. It sounds like he's talking about you. Yeah, it sure does. Um... Oh, Christ, Steve. Yeah, we got a little problem here now, too. Uh, th I think the goddamn shelf fell down and took this guy's foot off. Uh, if we can get a hand... Uh, Steve, please, not a joke. The shelf's down on this guy. I think one or two of his feet came right off. They're laying underneath the side of the shelf there. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you smell like a bad stink, it's just the cheese and I'll sit. Thank you. Uh, sir, in aisle five there with the brown jacket, glasses, gray hair, the, uh, we do have the covers on you, sir. We seen you in the battery aisle and you took a few batteries. We can't have that, please. Uh, otherwise we're gonna have to call the police. So, please, we'